Hello everybody, this is Chris aka CJ23MJ aka The Boss here and I got this tutorial kind of for you guys for anybody else that's interested in starting YouTube I just want to show you guys the cheapest, easiest way to do everything you want to with capturing your HD footage and then editing it and you get an editing program for free so let's start right off here the product that I use and I'll I also been getting a lot of comments about this too, so yeah, but anyway, the product I use to capture my uh, footage is this, the Elgato uh, Game Capture HD, and it's a very small device, a little bit bigger than iPhone, it's actually like 2-3 feet away from me right now. Um, basically, you, you um, if you have a PS3, you plug in the component cable into your PS3 and it hooks up to your uh, Elgato thing there. And then from there, as you can see in the picture, HDMI out and the the USB out on the right side of the d picture of the device. And the USB goes straight to your computer and the HDMI goes to your HDTV. And then you can buy this product for one, about 200 bucks off of their website. But what I did was I went to Amazon and you can get it for only 185 So I definitely recommend getting it off of Amazon even though you might have to wait a little longer. And so now once you capture the footage, uh, well actually before that, when you plug in the device, um, there will be a link kind of thing. I forget what pops up. I think it says to go to this link or whatever. And it's like, uh, you, it's, it'll, it'll give you the link. It's, it's on the container on the packaging too. But basically you download this capturing software right here. And basically all you do is... Um, yeah, you plug it in, you have settings for like, uh, if you can upload your videos directly to YouTube. However, that does not mean there's commentary on there because you cannot add commentary on this editing program that is completely, yeah, by the way, it's completely free with the device. Everything, like this editing program that you download, it's completely free, but the device itself costs the 185 And you can convert, you know, your new record videos to either of those, and then you can make it available for like iPhone or Windows Live Movie Maker. I, that's not what I use to edit my videos. I used to use it. And I'll show you an even better program to use in just a second here. But yeah, you can do all that stuff. And then also, you can... Uh, not right there. Um, this here shows what the input device is. You choose which one and then what uh, HD setting you want. And then all that you can choose if you want your picture, your uh, video to be a little brighter or whatever you know you can just change that um, so anyway moving on basically it's a pretty simple you start recording um, and so yeah you start recording you by hitting this button here the big red button and it'll start to record and then so yeah it's gonna start recording this video and then you hit it again to stop recording and say you forget to hit the record button while you are playing well you can just drag this back like if I kept this playing which I'm not going to you can drag it back up to two hours and then start recording what you just played so that's very useful then I go to edit and if the video hasn't processed yet it'll start processing longer videos obviously take longer to process then you can go back play your video back again basically all it is here is cut and edit so sometimes I'll do that like here's the cut and then you click on the clip and you can delete it or whatever you know or you can make it a new clip but anyway that's that so then what I do is oh wait I forgot to show you guys what I do is I'll export it and then I'll look I'll you can choose I think it's in the options somewhere where you want the video to be saved and so then after that I go into this program here I click on the add media and I choose from yeah all that stuff and so then I get the video on here it'll take a little while then you click on it drag it over and yeah voila this is a great video editing program completely free and basically uh, you can add there are some effects you can add to your videos I don't usually use them the audio tracks it's great you can add up to as many audio tracks as you want by uh, just just you know you can just keep adding there's yeah you can as make audio uh, soundtracks as you want and you can also like say like right here if you can see I have the beginning of the video in a different soundtrack because this part of the video is going to be like 
the volume is going to be a little down and so right here is where I'll start the commentary and on the commentary how I do that is like say I just wanted to start it just hit narrate and then hit this and I'm talking right now so this is recording my voice over this part of the video and so then I can hit to stop and then it'll save it over that little segment right there which I'm gonna get rid of that and yeah that's, that's how you do that uh, delete that yeah okay so then sometimes I'll do that but other times I'll use this audio program called audacity which I if you haven't heard it before I don't know why it's, it's pretty popular it's free you can get it off of this website here oh and by the way guys the video editing software I guess I didn't mention that sorry I'm going kind of out of order here but this is where you download it this website right here and all the links will be in the description guys so feel free to go there but you want to make sure you hit download the free version do not hit any of this other stuff hit download the free version and then you can go and download it and your computer might be like it might be unsafe it's it's fine just don't it's fine but anyway so yeah and it'll give you a 30 day free trial on all the premium stuff that's available in the software um, and by the way yeah the name is video pad video editor um, but yeah it'll give you all the stuff you can save your movie too this is how you save it to your computer and I would normally go with the mp4 file but I'm not allowed to do that because it's only available with the premium so those are the only formats you can do it in so that's how that all works and you save it to your computer and then you go to YouTube and then you upload um, but yeah, I think I pretty much covered everything, guys. What I use, uh, go over it real quickly again. I capture everything through here, and so yeah, I capture all my video through here. Maybe cut some clips here. Then I go into this video pad. Oops, go into video pad, and I add some more. Might do some effects. Yeah, here's the effects transitions. Might do some of these and then put the commentary over either with this or with audacity and then I'll see like here this is how you record you just record your voice here then stop and then file and then I export it as like a wave file or a mp3 file um, then put it then I add the media and add it onto here and then I save the movie save it somewhere and then I upload it to YouTube by then you'll have about three or four uh, either video like video or slash audio files but you can always go back and delete them and make sure guys when you do this if you do do what I do <laughs> that was really confusing do do what I do okay but if you do that then just make sure you organize all your videos and stuff because otherwise it can get to be a very big mess and you'll have problems finding the videos you just made but anyway that's all for now guys hope you enjoyed this and yeah uh, be a boss and subscribe uh, leave a like if you uh, enjoyed this tutorial and thought it was very useful and I encourage everybody anybody and everybody to start making a YouTube channel because it is very fun but anyway guys I'll see you later